Hi, I'm Johnny with Balloon Animals Palm Beach, and today I'm going to show you how to make a stock flower. It can be something like liatris or blazing star, hollyhock, any sort of stock shaped flower. It's very similar to. What you're going to need is a colored 260 or 160. I'm using a lilac 160 today because I'm making a bouquet, but in the past I usually use 260s. And a lime green. Um, 160 I'm using today for the stem, but again, you can use any sort of green 260 for the stem and any color 260 or 160 for the flower itself. So we're going to grab the lilac 160 and inflate it just a bit. If you're using the 260, you're just going to inflate it so it has about a 10 finger tail. The 160 I'm doing it so it also has a 10 finger tail. And you're gonna make one little one finger size bubble on a 260 on a 160, it's just a pinky size. And then you're gonna do three pinch twists. Three little pinch twists. And you want to bring your balloon up so that it's coming out the top of the pinch twist. And there's a little bubble on the bottom. And now you just make another little one finger size bubble and three more pinch twists. We're going to do this so that it has five pinch twist sections. One more one finger bubble and three more pinch twists. One more one finger bubble and three more pinch twists. One, two, three, four, so we want to do one more. One more one finger bubble and three pinch twists. longer today with a 260 this is plenty of length and but with a 160 because I'm going to be adding this to some daisies and roses I want to do another section which means I need a little more space in my balloon so I'm letting out a little bit of air and retying the knot I'm going to do one more one finger bubble and three more pinch twists Now I'm going to let out the air again. Tie that off. Wrap it around a couple times. And get rid of the extra. So that is the flower part of the stock flower. Now we're going to take our green 160 and inflate it almost all the way. And we're 
we're just going to decide which we want to be the top and which we want to be the bottom. I'm going to go ahead and make the nozzle in the top and I'm going to just wrap my nozzle in so it's hidden. And I'm going to attach this down here. So I'm just going to make all three pinch twists kind of going the same way and I'm going to just twist the nozzle of the green balloon into the three pinch twists to attach my balloon. Hide that away. Push it up in there. And that's your stock flower. You can make this pink, lavender, blue, whatever you want. And it works really well in flower arrangements. It kind of adds a little touch when you're doing a flower arrangement. If you like the video, you can click like or you can leave me feedback in the comments below or subscribe to my channel. I do release videos on a regular basis or you can check me out on Facebook or go to my website for more information, balloonanimalspalmbeach.com. Thanks.